Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the world of innovation, where the only thing getting more stretched than my patience with my neighbor's parking skills is Elon Musk's imagination. Have you heard the latest? Elon's been accused of plagiarism. Yes, that's right. The guy who's got more ideas than a toddler in a candy store has been called out for copying designs. Now let's talk about these new Tesla creations, the Cybercab and Robovan. Apparently, they look suspiciously like vehicles from the movie iRobot. I mean, I mean, if they look anything at my ex's dating profile, I can see why people are concerned. But the real kicker? Director Alex Proyas, the genius behind iRobot, posted on social media, Hey Elon, can I have my designs back please? And if that's not enough, Proyas pointed out that the robots from Tesla's presentation look just like the ones from his movie. Plus, the event's name, We Robot, feels a little too close for comfort, doesn't it? Apparently, he's been accused of plagiarism. Yes, you heard me right, plagiarism. And not from some random guy on the internet, it's from the automotive design experts at Car Scoops. Now, if you've ever driven a Tesla, you know that feeling of futuristic excitement mixed with a hint of, is this even legal? It's like Elon's trying to outdo himself every time he hits the drawing board. But now, it seems he might have taken a page, or a whole chapter, from VW's book. Car Scoops pointed out that both vehicles share remarkably similar silhouettes, narrow headlights, and get this, doors that lift upwards. Now, let's dive into the details. The Tesla Cybercab is a two-seater, fully autonomous taxi set to hit the streets in 2026. Priced at around $30,000, or about 27,000 euros, it's like the perfect blend of style and practicality assuming you're okay with having no steering wheel or pedals. This thing is so self-sufficient, it probably won't even let you change the radio station. Then we have the Tesla Robovan, a 20-seat electric bus. Talk about a ride! With no wheel or pedals, you can just sit back, relax, and let the car handle your family reunions. Imagine explaining to your relatives why there are no controls. Uncle Bob, don't worry, just trust the robot. He knows the way to Aunt Linda's. But here's my call to action for you. If you enjoy these nuggets of automotive wisdom and laughter, make sure to subscribe to our channel. After all, who wouldn't want to keep up with the latest on the world's most interesting car designer, who apparently moonlights as a movie villain?